Happy birthday, Research America. 25 years of challenge and achievement during which time you have never deviated from your mission. To keep the importance of research and discoveries in health at the forefront of the national debate. Pfizer has been with you since the beginning because we share your vision. Namely, that investing in research keeps our country competitive. The effectiveness of Research America is due to the partnership that has been created between uh, academia, industry, uh, biomedical research leaders in a variety of research institutions, and public policy and influential political leaders. Together, they have educated the American public and worked in partnership with the American public to advocate effectively on behalf of the advancement of biomedical research. Research America's advocacy aligns perfectly with the American Medical Association's core mission, which is to promote the art and science of medicine and the betterment of public health. And that's why we've supported Research America, both as a founding member in 1989 and up to the current day, because these scientific discoveries and innovations form the structure on which physicians build improved care for the citizens of our nation. Mary Woodard Lasker strongly believed that our nation's strength was in good part measured by our commitment to research for health. Her message to lawmakers was, if you think research is expensive, try disease. Research America is a leader in advocating to lawmakers in Washington for strong funding for biomedical science. The Lasker Foundation salutes you. Happy 25th. We at the Burroughs Welcome Fund have long been supporters of Research America. We view them as one of the primary, if not the primary, advocacy organization for biomedical research in the United States. And the Burroughs Welcome Fund is a fund committed and dedicated to improving biomedical research and education. My most memorable experience by far was going up to Capitol Hill with the Research America team back in late 2012. Participating in this event showed me the impact that a unified coalition can have. Through Research America's tremendous convening ability, I was teamed up with a fantastic group of students, patient advocates, and fellow researchers. And I must say, by far, seeing John Porter in action was a great learning experience for me. More than any other organization, Research America has a unique ability to bring together individuals and groups who share a commitment to the promise of science. Your conferences provide an ideal forum for sharing ideas, for learning, and for setting a vision for the future. At institutions like UCLA and all the University of California campuses, day in and day out, we are shaping the future of health, thanks in large measure to the unflagging efforts of organizations like Research America. Supporting robust medical research budgets in Washington, doing good times and bad, Research America has been a strong, consistently effective ally for those of us in academic medicine. We need a strong advocate. Research America is it. And if we can give them the necessary support, the necessary resources to do the best advocacy job, that's the way to ensure that American medical research stays at the top and, research, and healthcare in general, here and throughout the world, gets better and better. Over the last 25 years, as we have been pursuing bold and impactful medical research, we have relied on Research America to be our voice in Washington and throughout the country. And what a powerful voice it has been. It would be wonderful if we could say on your 25th anniversary, mission accomplished. But unfortunately, as we know all too well, the challenges continue to mount. On behalf of the American Cancer Society, I want to congratulate Research America on a quarter century of leadership in support of federal funding for medical research. I'm personally so proud to serve on the Research America board with the Honorable John Porter and so many other dedicated volunteers. I also want to congratulate Mary Woolley, a good friend, on her enormously effective leadership. I and the American Cancer Society look forward to another 25 years of excellence from Research America. 
As a driving force to increase federal funding in critical medical research, Research America is the key reason the NIH doubled its research budget in the early 2000s. And they continue to bring together stakeholders and raise awareness for the benefits of investing in, in research. I'm a strong, enthusiastic supporter of Research America, the important work it does in educating the American public and our congressional and state and private sector leaders on the importance of biomedical research. With research, today's intractable problems can become tomorrow's cures. I urge all of you to support this organization because it makes a better tomorrow for all of us. This is an organization that has a unified voice on, the, for, on behalf of the biomedical research community to support research. The value is working alongside with all these very smart people who are so passionate about supporting research and innovation. And the value is how much I learn from all the others, and we're all trying to do the right thing for the country, which is increasing the amount of science innovation that can make us competitive and that can improve health as well. Under the outstanding leadership of Mary Woolley, President of Research America, we are fighting together, alongside one another, to improve medical outcomes. For 25 years, we, together with Research America, have been advocates for basic research in this country. Research that helps us to understand mechanisms of disease, research that helps us to find new medicines that improve the lives of patients everywhere. Thank you.